we are expecting pole cards to be hitting doormats from the 10th of May onwards. Um, so about poll cards, a little bit about them. Uh, first of all, a poll card, if you receive one, that is telling you that you are registered to vote for the upcoming election. If you don't receive a poll card um, in the next couple of weeks, um, then you need to be contacting electoral services to check whether you're registered or not. A poll card in terms of what it's telling you, it's telling that you're registered to vote, but it's also telling you where you need to be going on polling day to cast your vote. Some electors who have chosen to vote by post, they'll be getting a postal poll card which will be telling them that they, their postal vote and when they are likely to expect to receive that. Um, you would also use your, your poll card to be checking the times of hours of poll. Mm -hmm. um, but also, people tend to think that they need their polling card to cast their vote. Yeah. If you know that you are registered, you don't need that poll card to be able to cast your vote. Um, you just need to be known your name, address, and the location of where you need to be going on polling day. Um, you can go into that polling station and cast your vote without that polling card.